today for the beloved WGN security guard shot and killed pumping gas two weeks ago on Chicago's south side. WGN's Megan Dwyer now live at her visitation for us. Megan. Micah and Ray, Selena Claiborne's family says her legacy will be love, and she wants, they want that love to live on through her daughters. You might remember that 35 year old Selena Claiborne stopped to get gas in the 6700 block of South Jeffrey around 3 in the afternoon on March 7th when police say two brothers, 22 year old Gregory Watson and 17 year old DeMonte Watson, tried to steal her car, but instead they ended up shooting her three times and then running away. She later died at the hospital. Claiborne was a security guard at WGN. She has two teenage daughters. Today, her friends and family came to honor her life. Selena's sister says Chicago police worked tirelessly to solve her murder and were able to do so because there was an outpouring of support from the community. Unlike in so many other cases, witnesses here were not silent. They came forward with video and evidence, and that's what this family says the city of Chicago needs more of. My sister was a light, and wherever she went, she touched people in their hearts. I mean, we had uh, every, everyone from mail carriers to back in the day when she used to donate plasma. They all coming out. So in the uh, stores, you know, the supermarket people, you know, so wherever she went, that's all they say. She was a beautiful person. Oh, she was just a, a, a light. She's just sunshine, you know, and that's the spirit that she leaves on and that we carry with us now. The family says they are incredibly grateful that her alleged killers were caught so quickly so no one else was hurt. We're live in the Auburn Gresham neighborhood. Megan Dwyer, WGN News. Thank you, Megan. Talks continue.